Mr. Jobel branded Brexit voters foolish and claimed the UK's exit from the European Union has led to stronger ties between the remaining nations. In an interview with the Financial Times, he said in voting to leave they made a great contribution to European integration. Though in the short term that doesn't really help Britain, he added that the Brexit vote showed how foolish it was to listen to demagogues who say, we're paying too much for Europe. A member of Angela Merkel's Christian Democratic Union CDU party, Mr. Schobel is a veteran of German politics and a firm believer in the European Union. However, he has been critical of some of the bureaucracy within the Union. After the historic referendum in Britain, Mr. Schobel called on the bloc to take a more intergovernmental approach to problem-solving, bemoaning the fact that EU politicians take too long to make important decisions. Speaking to German newspaper Welt im Santag, he said you soon realize if the Commission ISNT managing something or if we're getting bogged down in the European Council. And that's when governments have a responsibility, Getty Wolfgang Schobel called Brexit voters foolish Mr. Schobel is a well-respected figure in German politics, though he has received criticism from civil rights activists for his austerity policies and hardline on counter-terrorism, in voting to leave they made a great contribution to European integration Wolfgang Schobel the 75-year-old is Germany's federal minister of finance, a post he will soon relinquish to become speaker of the Bundestag, the German equivalent of the House of Commons, he was appointed to the his new role by Chancellor. Chancellor Angela Merkel, who has handed him the galling task of welcoming 94 alternative for Germany AFD politicians to the House, the fair at AFD party stunned Germany when they won nearly 13% of the vote at last month's election, and are expected to clash with Schobel over his pro-background. Getty Wolfgang Schobel will soon step down as German Finance Minister Mr. Schobel also serves on the German government's Brexit Committee, which details with the UK's departure from the EU. He started his political career in 1961 when he joined the youth branch of the CDU. Since then he has held down a number of high-profile roles, including Federal Minister of the Interior and CDU Party Chairman. In 1990 he was the victim of an assassination attempt which left him paralyzed. Wednesday, September 13, 2017 Getty Wolfgang Schauble survived an assassination attempt in 1990 The father of four was shot twice, once in the neck and once in the spin, has been confined to a wheelchair ever since. He battled health problems again in 2010, when complications from surgery and an allergic reaction to an antibiotic left him in intensive care. At the time German media speculated about his resignation and even his chances of survival. However, Mrs. Merkel twice declined his offer to resign and he made a full recovery.